um, Inquisitor has an article out ta saying that a uh, there was a civilian who reported a alien base in the southwest of Arizona. Uh, basically, government working with uh, aliens, and uh, he found a severed head. Apparently, I I, I read that story today. I mean, it was interesting. I'm gonna, but to find a severed head, wouldn't you want to give that to the police? Yeah, apparently he was too frightened or whatever because he thought he that he would be uh he would be caught with it. So that's uh that's the story on that. I just you know I don't know. It's very funny though. It's a very uh, interesting article. I uh. I came across it the other day, and I just it kind of it, it tickled my fancy. <laughs> it yeah, did. Just, uh, I mean, it was a good like. Sorry, I mean, I honestly, I mean, I don't know if if you want to believe this or not, but like I read the whole story, and what got me the most was that like when he saw aliens with um, military officials, and they were eating a human being. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, wouldn't you like try and take some photographical cool evidence of this so you can prove it? You know, you would think in a daily, in an age like this, that uh, even with all the other videos that come out, you know, of all the saucers that we see, because we see a lot of them on Twitter. Trust me, there's a, there is no, um, there's <laughs> there's no shortage of UFO pictures. Trust me, there's oh, not. Oh no. But, um, yeah, yeah, you would just think with cell phones, everything like that, so this, some, this guy would have snapped a photo or taken the severed head or, you know, something along the lines, but apparently uh, that, that wasn't the case. Apparently he, uh, but not only that, I, I'm actually leaving out more a little bit of this, too. This is actually an official document as well yes. that came out of this. This is actually from the website The Black Vault that described this uh, encounter that happened. So, uh, it's kind of crazy. I mean, it has a little bit of some uh, government, some government, you know, touch to it here. So it uh, it makes people wonder. And you know, I remember we talked about the Denver airport that uh, that uh, our last one of our last or a couple weeks ago, I should say, um, about how there is a, a supposed secret rail system that goes from Area 51 to Delsey, New Mexico, to uh, Denver Airport, and you know who knows it could go to this uh, supposed supposed base out here in Arizona. You know, I, I mean, I, I would really love to this to be true. And like, I, I talked to my brother about this today when we were driving around, and I told him, and you know, I mean, I would want to go out there just to see if the story is actually true. You want to get eaten by aliens? I, I wouldn't want to get eaten by aliens. No, I mean, I, I'd make sure I had some kind of weapon on me. Mm -hmm. But I mean, I, I'd go out and try and find this um, secret. Uh, base. I think you would let an alien plug your butt. I think that's what you would do. That'd freak me out. <laughs> just, no, if I saw an alien, I'm pretty sure I'd shit a brick. Yeah, you think you would, or you think it'd be like, oh, like Paul status, you know? You'd be like, oh. oh or do you think you'd oh freak? No, I, you know, I think knowing you, I think you'd run. <laughs> you think I'd run? I think you'd run. I mean, if it feels a friendly alien, like in Paul, I mean, shit. I mean, I offer you a cigarette, or offer me a, a joint. <laughs> Holy shit! Hell yeah! Let's get high. <laughs> nice. Uh, all right, we're gonna take our first break. We'll be right back, guys. <laughs> 